The Jedi Master Qui-Gon Jinn and the Sith Lord Darth Plagueis actually had quite a bit in common. They were two extremely important individuals in the galaxy that would never live to see their ultimate goals. Qui-Gon Jinn's ultimate goal being the training of Anakin Skywalker, and Plagueis' ultimate goal was for the Sith to rule the galaxy once more. Something else they had in common is they were both intellects, putting the Force above everything else. Although Plagueis admittedly was far more selfish with his use of the Force than Qui-Gon Jinn was, the two of them actually have quite a bit in common. Common. But something else that few people know is that the two of them have actually met before. And at the end of their meeting, Darth Plagueis even exclaimed how much he respected the capabilities of Qui-Gon Jinn, at least intellectually, and believed that he was a Jedi crafted from old, unlike many of the more modern Jedi Masters. Of course, during their meeting, Qui-Gon Jinn had no idea that the individual that he was speaking with was actually Darth Plagueis, as Jinn only knew Plagueis as the leader of the banking clan Higo Damas. But this is the story of how the Jedi and the Sith Lord met, and how the Jedi ultimately gained the respect of Darth Plagueis. Years before the Clone Wars conflict, a group of Jedi, meaning Sipho Dyas, Dooku, and Qui-Gon Jinn, ventured to Dooku's homeworld of Sereno. The Jedi ventured to Sereno to create a deal with Darth Plagueis, as of course the mission was wholly diplomatic. The Jedi had come to realize that Higo Damask and the banking plan controlled much of the galaxy through backdoor deals and trading routes. And because of this, the Jedi began to recognize Higo Damask secretly Darth Plagueis as one of the most influential beings in the galaxy. The only thing he really didn't truly have above the Jedi was political power, something that he was scheming for for his apprentice Darth Sidious. Higo Damask was very slow to give up his power and revelations to the Jedi Masters, as of course they were his true enemies, even though they didn't know it yet. What resulted was hours upon hours of debate, with Qui-Gon Jinn eventually actually taking the lead in the debate with Darth Plagueis, and how much information he was willing to reveal to the Jedi Masters. Masters. Qui-Gon Jinn eventually even accused him of making money over peace, something that was in all actuality true as the Sith Lord never really craved peace. Although this accusation and Qui-Gon Jinn not being afraid to confront one of the most powerful beings in the galaxy upright caused Darth Plagueis to respect the Jedi Master. Darth Plagueis saw that Qui-Gon Jinn called things for what they were, and Darth Plagueis even realized that Qui-Gon Jinn, even though he was a Jedi himself, understood the hypocrisy of the Jedi Order, and that this Jedi was similar to the Jedi of old, and not the more modern, complacent Jedi Masters. This Jedi served the Force above all else, even the Jedi Order, something that Darth Plagueis grew to respect over their conversation. After the debate was concluded, the Jedi had made quite a lot of progress with Higo Damas, with at the end of the conversation, Higo complimenting Dooku that he had trained his Jedi Padawan well, and that he was now a proficient Jedi Master. The next time Darth Plagueis would see Qui-Gon Jinn, it would be from afar, as he once encountered him again when Qui-Gon Jinn brought the young Anakin Skywalker to the planet of Coruscant. Seeing the two of them together and sensing the immense power of Anakin Skywalker filled the Dark Lord of the Sith with much fear, as he realized that if any Jedi were to train the young Skywalker effectively and the chosen one that would one day destroy the Sith, it would be Qui-Gon Jinn. But that was the story on how the Dark Lord of the Sith Darth Plagueis met the Jedi Master Qui-Gon Jinn, and how Qui-Gon actually managed to gain the respect of Darth Plagueis, even though he had no idea he was conversing with the Dark Lord of the Sith. But what are your guys' thoughts on this? And did you know that Qui-Gon Jinn had actually met with Darth Plagueis before? Or is this brand new information for you? Before you guys go, I want you to check out the link in the description and go to the Star Wars merch page. We have some brand new designs for you guys that I think you guys will really like. Also, we're doing a big sale right now of 25-30% to 30 off most things on the page. So even if you guys don't end up buying anything, just be sure to check it out. And if you do, be sure to let me know in the comments down below. Anyway, my friends, thank you guys so much for all of your support on the YouTube channel. May the Force be with you and have a great day.